A national shortage of school nurses. Well, that's nothing new, but it's now posing new challenges with COVID-19. And here at the Mountain State, a state nursing association says one reason for failing to staff more school nurses is simply the lack of funding. But as 13 News reporter Haley Kosick found out, it's not just a money issue. Right now, the ratio for school nurses in West Virginia is one uh, certified school nurse, which is a registered nurse, for every 1,500 students, kindergarten through seventh grade. So teachers aren't the only ones feeling overwhelmed. By West Virginia law, every county must have at least one school nurse. That's a minimum of one nurse for all the schools in that district. School districts will tell you there's just not enough money to go around. The West Virginia Association for School Nurses agrees and says under the CARES Act, there will finally be additional money to help hire the bodies to tackle the challenges for the upcoming school year making sure that you know contract contact tracing is going to be an overwhelming job so i feel like you know, making sure that they've got everything they need to do that or maybe put that give that to somebody else i feel like that's going to be a big job for school nurses on top of everything that they've already got going on the West Virginia Nurses Association has teamed up with the state's association for school nurses to advocate for them. So we support whatever it is the school nurses say that they need, then we would we would support whatever legislation that they had in mind, help get a bill written and then lobby to get that bill passed. School nurses are responsible for the wellness of their students and staff and have been working all summer to stay on top of ever changing reentry plans. We've, we've worked under crunches before, and um, it's not that we like to, but that's what nurses do. You provide the care that, that everybody needs. But Knapp says the crutch this year is the biggest anyone has faced before. In Charleston, Healy Kosick, 13 News, working for you. And tomorrow night, the West Virginia Nurses Association will hold its first Zoom forum, encouraging school nurses and district officials to express their concerns and needs for the upcoming school year.